International Atomic Energy supports us in two different ways. The one is to provide in equipment because we didn't have enough equipment to develop and upgrade our existing facilities and also with the professional training. So we got as doctors as well as the technologists that we received different kind of training in different countries to make familiar with the equipments. Nuclear medicine can be used for the diagnosis of the diseases in two different ways. In vitro diagnosis is that we take the sample of the patients, either blood sample or the tissue sample, and then we use the radio amino assay, like in a lab that we do use radioisotopes outside the body. The other technique is that that is in vivo diagnosis, that is that we inject or we ask the patient to drink, especially the radioactive iodine, then we can do the scan to diagnose diseases. This is the dual head spec gamma camera. Uh, that this, is, this can be used for several purposes, but especially we use this gamma camera for the diagnosis of th uh, cancers, especially the thyroid cancer and the breast cancer and the prostate. Different cancers uh, function in different ways, so you have to select the appropriate radioisotope for the imaging. So this radioisotope will localize or identify the abnormal areas or the cancer cells. When it comes to the treatment for the diseases, nuclear medicine can act in a very different ways, but especially uh, the thyroid cancer patients that we can use radioactive iodine for the treatment. They are that you use radioiodine capsules to destroy their cancer cells. Once the patient is diagnosed to have cancer, the oncologist they will start treatment, but once they start treatment, they don't know whether they, the patient got cured or not. So this is the technique that we use, the nuclear medicine imaging or the isotope imaging to diagnose whether the patient had uh, responded to treatment or whether the patient is still having disease. So that is what we call follow-up. Without agency support, I think this place would have been closed by now because uh, of the prevailed 30 years war in this country, we could not develop this place. 